Friday YouTube. So we are going over here to peel up over here at the pilot, which is the old Wilco house over here in St. Mary's, Georgia. There weren't no load picking up. The one load I had was canceled. So we, uh, there weren't nothing picking up after that. So we had to wait. And the only load that we could get was picking up today. So we ended up sitting here 57 hours waiting. Got it reset. I'm supposed to be going home. But I got two things I need to do real quick. So, what we're going to do is, this is a boring situation. I got to peel up real quick. So, I will uh, let you guys go and I will catch you when we, we're not putting much in. We're only putting 50 gallons in. But I got to put some uh, DE up in and as you can see, I got to watch the window. So, we get just started with the app here. Because the pilot has an app on your phone, which is awesome. Makes it easier, just that it's a little bit pricey around here for fuel. So that's why I'm only going to do 50 gallons, but I also got to do DEF, which DEF is outrageously priced. I don't, I mean, come on now, Georgia. I mean, $3 a gallon for DEF, I mean, it's, it's just cow piss and some ingredients, some chemicals, I mean, that's just a little bit outrageous. But of course, we got poor service, like always, so. Yeah, we're having trouble connecting, of course, we're having trouble connecting. See, this is bull. All the money that people spend on cell phones a month, you would figure that these companies would build better antennas or put more antennas in. Now, you find better service when you're sitting right in the middle of towns and stuff in big cities. They don't really care about the small ones. See, this is bull. That means I can't get my... Come on, you gotta move now. That means I can't get my damn points. It's bad enough that you only get one point here at Snyder because it's, you're not allowed to get any more points. One point a gallon, every time you put a gallon in, so you, you only put 50 gallons in, you only get 50 cents. Oh, what a bagging. I don't understand why this app's not working today. But hell with it. All right, I'll, I'll just talk to you guys after. All right, bye. Alright, I'm putting this on glass because people said that there's no way my truck, there's no way my truck at 70 miles an hour can go a good few miles. And as you can tell, I got good few miles. Uh, I got 896 miles, 0.8. And you got 82 miles to the gallon. That's doing it between 70 to 71 miles an hour. Um, so that's that's not too bad. Whoops. Sorry about that. One moment. Hey, come on, Daddy. Come on. Get the money in there. Just sit down. Just sit down. Don't worry about it. All right. Still supposed to wait a little bit more, so probably what I'll have to do is take Max a rule out for a minute. This is gonna be a driving video, but not really a long one. Maxie, will you wait, honey? Hold on, hold on, please. We'll go outside in a minute. I'm not gonna hold you today. Not today, buddy. It is. 9.15 here, local time, and it's 96 degrees right now, and of course I don't like to run my AC, but I guess at this temperature here, Max and Brew needs to have some AC, so, but Max needs to go out to go to the bathroom real quick before we leave. I'll get back with you guys when I get over there to the 
shipper. Like I said, I don't put out the name of the companies that I'm going to. Uh, that's just that's just the way. That's just the way it is. I just don't like people knowing what I'm hauling. So I just say I'm picking up a load. It's not supposed to be that heavy. It's going to it's only going to South Carolina. Um, I think like 300 miles. So it's about six hours. The live load, live unload. Uh, the next one that we're picking up, picking up at the same, not the same. It's the same company's name, but not the same place. And it's going to um, Elwood, Illinois. So that's good. So this way, because we need to have start heading up towards um, home. The white's getting all ready. Um, we got two things we need to do. We got our 90 day inspection we need to get done. And we also need to get done is take that driving test thing there to make sure I know how to drive still. So, yes buddy. So anyway, so let me let you go because Max is yelling at me. And I will catch up with you guys after we get loaded. Alrighty, bye.
I gotta put my brakes on just so you can pass me. Jesus, if you can't drive, get the hell out of the left lane. Jesus. I'm freaking angry right now. Freaking time.
He has to go on YouTube. Made it over here to Florence, South Carolina. Um, like I said, I can't do my delivery until tomorrow. And they had no place over there to park. So I put myself at 14 miles out. Um, let's see if I can move this GoPro. But anyway, they put myself 14 miles out. For the destination, um, it's nine o'clock tomorrow, so that'll be all right. Um, got myself some supper and stuff. Got Maxi all set. Um, just trying to shut this front curtain. I probably didn't even show anything, did it? I apologize. So anyway, so yeah, we got everything done. Sit here, use my new wave, that thing works awesome. My hot plate. Now, I have a question. Okay, they say bread's bad for you, okay? And hopefully you guys can see me here. Let me turn this light on just in case. All right, they say bread's bad for you, all right? But now, I was reading the back of a loaf of bread and uh, Grab this one. It says 120 calories. Okay. Two slices has 120 calories. That's what it says. Because it says serving size is two. Okay. So if the serving size is two and it's 120 for two, well, what I did is I got a bread knife picked up at Wally World. I took one slice of bread and cut it in half. Alright? So, I'm figuring with cutting that in half, I think I just cut the calories, right? That's what I think. Let me know. Let me know what you think. It's fairly easy to cut it. You don't have to have, you know, Texas toast or anything like that. I just figured, you know, I love bread. You know, and I want bread. And that's all it is to it. Sorry about that. My mat fell. Had to pick it up real quick. So anyways, that's what it is. We're here. Um, oh, shit. I didn't even log myself off. Uh, change sleeper okay making 31 minutes I was on the phone with dispatch and I had to go over some stuff with them I guess over some stuff and it's the same thing I hear every year every every time that a major holiday comes or, or whatever but anyway so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna eat edit this video and uh, and I will chit chat with you guys later. I uh, hope you enjoyed the enjoyed the little video that I made driving. It weren't much because those roads were crappy, um, but I got some. So, anyways, like I said, anything's possible as long as you put your your heart and mind to it. You can succeed at anything. And he would like to say, Maxie, you gotta say goodbye to people. Say say bye to your friends. Goodbye, friends. Get here. Say bye. Say bye to the camera. I know. Yeah, all your friends are on there. Okay. So Maxie says goodbye, and he will talk to you later. All right. Thank you, guys. All right. Bye.